gentlemen and ladies, it's me, Tenran432, and welcome to the March 20th, 2024 channel update video. Now the last fiscal year of operation for this channel has been one of, if not the best, we've ever had. Since the last March 20th, we've put out seven projects of considerable size. And before we move on to talking about the future of the channel, I'd like to go back and review everything that we've accomplished here at Tenza Center Project. If any of these projects catch your eye, you can go ahead and watch them. They're all still available on my channel, and I'll provide links in the description below. Now, without further, further ado, we'll be beginning right away with the game. Now, this project was my second trailer for my high school's drama department, following up the Lion King trailer from earlier in the year. And it also it serves as a memento for one of the funniest and honestly underrated shows I've ever been a part of. If you're interested in watching the full production of Game of Tiaras, that is linked in this and that video's descriptions. It's free bootlegs of a high school play. Just don't tell them that I sent you. Or that I recorded them. French? Or that I uploaded them. Or that... Well... JPTPBR. Jackson's plot, Tensing's plight, Bailey was right. This was actually a project created for my film as literature class, and it's a really fun, reflexive style doc slash mockumentary that kind of, kind of blurred the lines between reality and fiction in my own life. That's how good it was. Now, such a dramatic piece was of course based on the premise of uh, our good friend Jackson's plot to ride every Disneyland ride in one day, excluding Star Wars land rides, Tensing's plight, to create a film documenting the madman's journey, and of course that Bailey was right. Now, right about what? I actually cannot say. You're just gonna have to go and watch the film. Now, okay. Now, I worked on this project for, for two years. It was a real roller coaster of emotion, joy, and horror in its creation. And I have to again thank my man Owen Page for creating the original soundtrack for Oak Kid, and as well for the giant cast that worked with me to create such a stupid little three-part, 45-minute experience. Now, Oak Kid, it's a dumb superhero movie about a dumb superhero and dumb gang members in a convoluted plot of revenge, a criticism of reactionary philosophy, a plot of secret political uprising that I literally just kind of threw in there and forgot to explain. In the end, it's not my greatest work, but it was a lot of fun to make, especially the fight scenes. I'm actually kind of happy with the fight scenes. I learned a lot from making it. It's still up on the channel if you're interested in watching it. Now, of all the lessons that I learned from Oak Kid, I think one of the biggest was avoiding biting off more than I could swallow. And after Oak Kid, I chose to downsize things a bit, which led to one of my favorite projects that I've ever done. That, of course, being... Now, this was another project initially created for my film as literature class. This one was originally titled Milk Scenario, now it is the, uh, the Terrible Milks. To this day, I still think it's one of our greatest projects. The highlights here, obviously the pretty lighting, the set design, and this lovely two-person cast that took my vision about a milk addiction and just did an absolutely fantastic performance and delivery of such a disturbing concept that is milk. Uh, please go watch it. I'm very proud of what we were able to do here, and I don't think it's gotten enough love, so go check it out. Now, moving right along, we've got perhaps my greatest of my movie trailer-style projects. Now, the Adams Family trailer is just such a fun project with so many little film gimmicks. We've got the ghosts, we've got the aspect ratio changing, we've got the rotoscoping for the color, we've got the heart sequence. Where did we go wrong? Now, beyond just being a really fun shoot, this particular video reminds me of what a great production the Adams Family was. And having the opportunity to actually play Gomez Adams was just fantastic. Now, the live production of Adam's Family is also linked if you're interested in seeing it. And it really is something great. And everybody that was involved in it, you're all amazing. Now, if you weren't in the Adam's Family, you can go ahead and be amazing too by just going over and watching that video. I don't make any money from this kind of thing, but I can if I get enough views. So be a dear and go give me some views. Just a penny for the old guy. That's me. I'm the old guy. I am the old guy in John Lee, Von Peters, and Monet. 
Now, John Lee von Peters and Manet is an action follow-up to the tragedy of John Lee and von Peters, a project that we created entirely in one day, start to finish. Now, while that was a great project, it was one that needed a follow-up since it ended with such a dramatic cliffhanger ending. About a year and a half later, we filmed John Lee von Peters and Manet also in one day, but mysteriously, it took about a year and a half in the editing room because I was just so busy with other things. Now, at this point, the film, I feel, is up on my personal gold standard for short films. It's got action, it's got comedy, it's, a little, it's got a little bit of heart, and the extra editing time uh, let me do this really cool effect that I learned from the Addams Family, and overall, I'm just really happy with this one, too. It even has a good ending. I didn't mess up the ending, believe it or not. You know, that's something I tended to do a lot in my writing. Endings, they, they would just kind of... They would either have really rushed endings, or they would just kind of drag out and go on for too long. You know, it kind of kills the pacing at the end. Uh, I just kind of don't really know what to do, you know? And, uh, yeah. And now fast forward to today, March 20th, 2024. I've just a couple weeks ago put out a tribute video to Sweet Trip, my favorite man of all time. Kind of a strange music video hybrid. I put many hours into that one, and to be honest, a looming dread hangs over me as I realize this here video is the one that people will be watching, this, this regular show clip that I literally just re-uploaded from Discord. I didn't even modify it, you know? And uh, it appears that my laziness has been amply rewarded. Do, do you know how distressing this is? Anyways, as I fight the urge to add to the proverbial dumpster fire, that is, videos that actually get views by switching to lazy, short-form, garbage video style, I've just got three more videos loaded in the chamber for you guys to enjoy. First up, a different kind of video, in which I showcase one of my other hobbies, of course being juggling. This is a pretty exciting one, and I dare say it's a pretty cool looking video with a cool soundtrack. It's pretty short, and it'll be releasing next week on Friday at 6pm. <laughs> After that, we've got a short film that I directed for the Modesto 48 Hour Film Competition. It didn't win any money, unfortunately, but it was a great experience, and I think it'll win your hearts when you see it in a few weeks. It's perhaps the most grounded plot that I've ever made, partially due to the fact that I had some good friends with me on the writing team. Now, overall, this was just a great exercise, and I think you'll enjoy it. The film to follow that, it just started hailing, randomly. It's a sunny day. I don't know why it's hailing outside. Anyways, the third project to follow that is a surprise. I would love to tell you what it is, but then I would have to kill you. Anyways, that's all I have for today. So if any of the mentioned projects sound interesting to you, you can check out the ones that I've already posted on my channel, or subscribe so you know when new stuff comes out. Alternatively, you can, you can leave this video and never see my channel again. You know when in the end, it's fully in your control. Well, I won't take any more of your time, guys. Have an excellent morning, afternoon, evening, night, tea time, whatever time it is where you are. I'm Tenran432, Tenzing Rangel. Peace and cheap.